think I'm being too hard on them? Uh, well, maybe a little. How's that? How's that? How am I being hard on them? <laughs> Come on, it's not like they're being easy on us, are they? Well, it's. I take the Which one? This one. What do you find offensive? I kind of offended by her myself. <laughs> I don't like her. And you don't think he deserves it? No, I don't think he deserves it. Congress has been terrible. He's done a lot. Congress? Wait a second. Wait a man's been in power for us. Now, let's just look at the 28 pages, all right? Now, the 28 pages that Obama promised to release in 08 when he was campaigning. Oh, I'm going to release them. Bush shouldn't have, she shouldn't have said to them, you should read them. Well, seven and a half year later, years later, we're still waiting for those pages to be released. Well, it's been going through the courts. The victims of 9-11, right? Uh, uh, well, you know, we need to read those pages. So a judge finally said, these people need to read these pages. We need to find out. Now, the people that have read those pages, those in Congress, with top secret clearance, have said, in a bipartisan push, to get no, these pages no. out. Now, those pages will change the course of history. Well, if they're that important, why hasn't Obama kept his promise to release them? But instead of doing that, he's defying the judge's orders. He's on a plane to Saudi Arabia to kiss the ass of the man that the 28 pages say. Oh, he's on a plane there right now. That the 28 pages say, this is what it qualifies, that the Saudi government financed, trained, and gave us those 9-11 attack attackers. So it was not a terrorist attack. It was a state-sponsored attack against the United States, which makes what Bush did and what Obama's doing to hide, covering for him, treason. So if you think I'm being light on these guys, why don't you say that to the people that died in 9-11? Well, you can't do that or say it to their victims that have for seven and a half years now, for 13 years now, been suffering, looking for answers why we couldn't read those uh, 30, 28 pages. So if you want to go ahead and stick up for this guy and blame it on Congress, Congress ain't stopping him from releasing those pages. Why don't you look at the good things he's done? What, what good things? To... Name one. Well, like, we stopped the war. What, 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 we got more people fighting overseas now than we had when Bush was in office. We were in Libya, he's turned that into a cesspool. Yeah. We're you in talk Syria. A lot, but you don't listen. That's probably why you don't know what's going on. Oh, I'm done. But I'm here <laughs> telling you about the 28 pages you know nothing about no, while listen, you're sticking listen, up with no, this I man. Don't. Listen to one thing. Who was in power when 9 11 happened? And why hasn't Obama no, listen, held listen, him accountable? See what I mean? See how you are? And why hasn't see Obama held are? him accountable? Instead, he gave him immunity. Here's something else you don't know and accuse me of not knowing. There were two cases going to court in August of 2013 when this son of a bitch was trying to get a gun fight on the side of Al-Qaeda. Uh, but something that Bush wouldn't even do, that it would put the entire Bush administration in jail for war crimes. Obama had we older have, step in. Have, hey, See, Obama had older step in like and quashed those cases. For every one but you ain't listening like. to a fucking one of them. Well, that's right, and you're not listening to one of mine. Because you don't let me finish. Obama finish gave the you. Bush administration immunity for war crimes. That's the man you're protecting. Okay. The man that's going ahead and protecting the 28 pages. On a mountain and Why can't where we he was. We were within a quarter mile of him. We knew where he was, and Bush wouldn't let us go in and get him. Why Talk then? Why the, isn't he held the him the accountable? Army of Rangers. Then why hasn't Obama held him accountable? Why didn't, Obama, why didn't Obama stop all the cases? You don't listen. Why are you listening? I'm asking you the answer to the question. Why didn't Obama go ahead and go after him? You can't answer that, can you? That'd blow your whole damn world apart. Big pill, man. But here's the deal. And you're talking about that loan he supposedly got from Searles, which was paid back. No, no, no. I'm saying he only, he only gave $250,000 to this campaign. Everything else that he's given is a loan, meaning that it's going to be paid back. How is it going to be paid back? The money getting that is back to it. Getting back to the 9 11. Getting them back people. to the 9 11. He's the only man that has brought it up in the campaign. He chased the bush out with it. When he brought it up, that's why Bush turned tail and ran. And now he's the only one that keeps on saying those pages need to be 
least. When Bernie Sanders was asked about it yesterday, he says, Oh, I just don't think that uh, that's important. We gotta worry about other things. Other things, Bernie? Other things? The 3,000 people again? I still park it on. I don't know anybody else coming out with the real honest truth of 9 11. 9 11 is an inside job. Yeah, yeah, you know like, it, I know it, like, people walking by know it. I mean, it's, a, it's an inside well, job. it was an inside job because there were Muslims here that could park. No, because there were, <laughs> this was in the Washington Post headlines awesome. that there were people within our government that allowed the 9 11 attacks to happen. That was in the Washington Post two days ago. So this is something we can say. Well, we had a lot of evidence, but nobody put it all together. That's <laughs> because there's never been a real, true criminal investigation of it. Which one? Yeah. The one that had the 28 pages. No, 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 no. Those congressmen were not criminal investigators. They're congressmen. No, they don't investigate it themselves. They have staff do that. Those guys don't. No, 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 no. Don't bet all the, all the evidence, the very next day, Evidence was being carted away from the night. Crime scenes were obliterated. People were told to stand down, that we're taking over, it's none of your business. They carted all the steel off the China like this. There was no criminal investigation of 9-11. The Jersey girls, the same ones that are pushing for 28 pages to be released. We're going, what? No investigation. Well, push it, push it, push it, push it. It was only was because of the Jersey girls that we even had a 9-11 commission report. They wouldn't even have, and then it was just like Zelik, who who's started, who was the head of it, okay, was so the knew. bush buddy. He was a bush butt buddy. We knew about Pearl Harbor, too, but we didn't stop that. Oh, but so that makes it okay that we killed no, three, but our government it. allowed 3,000 people to get murdered, and that makes it okay because we know about Pearl Harbor. Okay, listen to me. All I'm saying is, the Muslims are yeah, supposed to kill the Well, we let them in. We know what's going to happen. We train them. They were staying at the White Carolina State over here in Alabama. That was on their driver's license. The damn hijackers were at the Air Force Base. I'm just saying, they didn't put it together. They, they didn't put it together. They trained them. They How do you train. mean that the FBI they had them on their, on their list a long time ago? The Air Force the Air did. Before. Uh, able Jane, Able Air Danger, Able Danger, Able Danger, right? Air Force don't train us. Listen to me, Able Danger was run by Lieutenant Colonel Anthony Schaefer, testified before Congress. We had them all. We had them all. We had terabytes full of information on them. We could have stopped them at any time. This is before Congress. We were told to stand down twice. Twice we were told to stand down. Now, so why, why is it doing? Colonel Schaefer read those 28 pages, too. But this is made as a head of able danger, a military outfit that was specifically designed to track down terrorists and kill them. He was like our 007. Look him up, Colonel Anthony Schaefer. I'll look him up. I'll look him up. I'll look him up. How about building number seven? Can you explain to me how that building ever came down? Yeah. Is that the one that was across from the World Trade? From oh, where we're standing, yeah. that brick building went out. Yeah. And it did this in six seconds. It wasn't hit by anything. I don't know. Well, let me let me educate you. I don't, I don't. I didn't watch that. I mean, I watched the twin towers go down, but I had to go down. People get murdered by a state. The state-sponsored attack that we are now coddling these people for 13 years and kissing their ass. North Tower. According to the New York Times, the fire leads to intense scrutiny of the towers and eventually to a decision to install sprinklers. On May 4, 1988, a 62-story skyscraper in Los Angeles burned for three hours and spread over four floors. It did not collapse. You have to compare the design. On February 23, 1991, Again, a 38-story skyscraper one day in built in 1973 all burned for more than 19 okay. hours and spread well, over eight floors. Apples, it did not oranges. collapse. Again, as I ask, is go to the architects and engineers. A 56-story skyscraper like said, in Venezuela, lot, lot built in 1976, like burned for over 17 hours and spread over 26 answer. floors, eventually but reaching... I'm not talking about conspiracy, I'm talking about what? hardcore physics collapse. here. On February 12, 2005, the Windsor Building up. in Madrid, a 32-story tower framed in steel-reinforced concrete, Burned for almost lead, 24 hours, completely so eradicating the upper tower. You, know, you never have the you never have the physical evidence. Say, the building itself. You know, we got the physical evidence. Oh, we had, well, we had the we had the bomb residue. 
Yes. Yet, Where? They, look again. Go look at the evidence. They have it. They've done independent investigations on it. I mean, they've done analysis. But they, you know, does you know, somebody have the evidence that was marked? Yes, yes. And where it's in yes, the if the proper, proper channels were followed, so it was never contaminated. All I can say is I, uh, I think I'm a very, uh, what do you say, uh, distrusting person as a rule, and I think so are you. I don't believe everything I hear, see, or read. <clears throat> So but I don't get into this conspiracy stuff until I have some really good evidence. Well, sir, I've given you enough on your plate to go look up. Let's go look it up, yeah. And then you get back with me and let me know if I have sure. rocked your yeah. world. I got your email. All right, have a good one. All right, go have that drink. Maybe you'd like to try to give me one. No, I'm just surprised that you don't. <laughs> Football! <laughs> Sorry, man. <laughs> oh, you want to give me two white guys? No. <laughs> you know what? I, I would enjoy talking to you if you just listen. I mean, I'm telling you that there are detectives and engineers that don't like the tree. Pressure gauge, it's been the biggest buildings in the world. Bridges, skyscrapers, you name the whole shopping center, right? The Spanish has been the head of architects and engineers, 2,500 on the architects and engineers, some of them are the best in the world. Huh? They say the buildings never fail. They say the buildings don't fail in fire. They speak your language. That's what I'm saying. Go and listen to what the man has to say. He speaks your language. I'm not an engineer. I listen to him and his other people. They speak your language. Now they put it later. If you want to get fancy, they will be able to get fancy. This guy has been lecturing now for the past 12 years. Going around telling me that they've done this stuff. It's like he did it. They said that these buildings came down with the whole demolition. They found nano thermite all in the debris. Nano thermite is a high grade military explosive. They found it in the air. Why bother to fly it? Well, the debaters were able to film these fall down for no reason. They had to have a reason that they would look like it. Let me ask you this. I'm going to give you the other side. When you give you give this to me. Let me ask you this. Are you the rocks of the Austin Bears Canada? No, this is the architects and engineers for 9-11 Truth. Just look at the building. No, no, they look at it. Oh, they've got the name of the guy that designed it. He designed it.